Hello everybody, welcome to the Peace Security Channel. Today I've got Zone Alarm Firewall with me, which is a very popular product from Zone Alarm. Tons of people use this daily and I just wanted to test it out and see how effective it is in preventing shared A malware infections. I do know that this thing is meant to be used with an antivirus program, but um, I want to see how it can deal with the malware by itself because an antivirus program doesn't uh, do anything much different it just reduces the amount of malware that this thing has to deal with so I'll be testing it on its own so first of all I'll give it the Komodo leak test but before that let's uh, see how much RAM it's using the RAM usage from their you know antivirus and firewall product was alarming but it's good to see that in this case it's uh, much more manageable. It's about 20 megs. That's neat. So let's give it the Komodo Lake test and see what kind of score it can manage. Well, in case you don't know what this thing does, it, it tries different methods of, uh, you know, different kinds of intrusions and it tests the program. If it manages to get through, then it's. Uh, says it's vulnerable if uh, it's unable to do what it tries to do then uh, it says it's protected like in this case you can see that injection of known DLLs was allowed and uh, that could lead to malware infections so I'm just going to hit deny every time it asks me and let's see what kind of a final score it gets So the test is done, and the final score is 250 out of 340. So it blocked 25 of the 34 operations, which is not bad. It's quite decent, in fact. So, okay, it's not uh, the best. It could be better, but it's not too bad either. Now let's see how it does against, uh, you know, some random malware that I'm going to pick. These are all, you know different kinds of confirmed malware so if zone alarm doesn't block it pretty much uh, the system is infected there's no other possible alternative that one got caught and blocked okay I'm getting the same alert again suspicious behavior saying remember this setting and I will deny now this is not good I'm getting the same alert again so what's happening basically is that the process is trying to create do the same operation again and again and zone alarm is not terminating it now because uh, there is no option here to terminate what a standard user would do once this keeps happening is basically just hit the allow button and uh, that's going to lead to your system getting infected now this doesn't make any sense at all to me when I say remember the setting why do I keep getting an alert I mean it's just endless array of alerts it's never gonna stop and uh, this is not good so right now I'll just terminate the process but if this keeps happening I'm just gonna hit allow because that's what any user would do no user would take the pain to go into task manager search for which application is causing the problem and then just go ahead and terminate it I mean I wouldn't do that in this case that's going to work but uh, this just keeps happening I mean it's it's not doing what it's supposed to do because the user is going to get infected anyway just hitting deny as many times as I can ok 
Okay, here's trouble again. This thing is... It just keeps on happening, and I can't get rid of it. Let's see if I just hit deny, does that solve the problem? Uh-oh, this is not good. Looks like in spite of me trying to help Zone Alarm in every possible way, um, a brand new security program, Rogue security program, has got installed. And this is basically going to wreak havoc in my system. It's just chaos and, you know, after this, pretty much, uh, tons of problems are going to follow. Should have been blocked. I don't know if now zone alarms working anymore. Oh no. So it looks like it's pretty much, uh, you know, everything's getting in now. No, it looks like zone alarm's still there, but it missed uh, those things, or at least uh, did not catch them quickly. Mm, so let's just see if the system remains usable after this, because, okay, uh, it's not going to give up. Oh no. Come on, leave me alone. So it looks like Zone Alarm's blocking a fair number of uh, intrusions, but uh, a lot of the malware is still making it through can see right now it looks like it's shut down Windows Explorer and um, and these things are just they're just not stopping no matter how many times I tell it to deny it and this is just an average user would just uh, and task manager has been disabled so oh my god it's, it's a total mess now an average user would just hit allow at this moment but I'm gonna keep denying let me s I can't even terminate the process so I have to give in here can't do much so oh damn so I'll just reboot the computer and let's see if it's still usable if it is, we'll try to use some other scanners. If it's not, well, the answer is simple. The system's just rebooted, and, um, you know, it's a total wreck here. There's no zone alarm anymore. It's uh, out of service, and uh, there's no more task manager either. So the malware successfully messed up the system. And um, what it's done is it's disabled my VirtualBox service, so I can no longer access uh, my files on my host machine, which means uh, it's going to be, you know, a problem. And uh, let's see if we can access the internet. Fine. Pretty sure that would be messed up too. So there's tons of malware on this machine, no doubt, and. Uh, now that zone arms go gone, there's nobody blocking their activities, and they're just like free to do whatever they please to this computer, and uh, you know it's a, it's a wreck. Zone alarm did block some things, but uh, you know that was just nowhere near enough.
see if we've got some strange toolbars if we can connect or not oh what a neat home page thank you malware and oh I've got a brand new action center that's great and it turned off uh, Internet Explorer as well so apparently there's no way for me to um, you know scan this computer because I cannot uh, use the internet neither can I go to my host machine so malware's done a great job today congratulations and as for zone alarm rest in peace